there are a few reasons why I chose to study in Australia and one of which is the educational system. They are so flexible that it allows the student to just take the courses, the subjects that interest him, not the general subjects that you have to take in other institutions in other countries otherwise. Number two is the environment. I went to University of Ballarat, situated in an old mining town called Ballarat City in Victoria. And the city is just beautiful, perfect, quiet, conducive to studying. The university also gave us the right equipment, the right facility, and uh, the right tools to improve ourselves in whatever endeavor that we were uh, going after. For instance, in my case, I wanted to be a, a broadcaster since, since day one. And the university just offered top-notch tools, facility, and equipment. In my case, I've always wanted to be a broadcaster and a media person since day one. They had laboratories and all. And back in 2005, here in the Philippines, it was unimaginable to have even at least two computer labs in a university. And there at the University of Ballarat, we had more than 12 computer laboratories with free internet. And during that time, it was just heaven for students like me. The university was so well equipped that a serious student can really make it outside the university once he graduates because of the training that he gets. But what is more important also is the government allowed students to work part-time. And from the community radio, I was able to move on to special broadcasting service, which opened my horizon and gave me the opportunity to use all of the professional equipment that any professional broadcasting station, TV or radio would use. When I came back to the Philippines, I applied for a national television network and a national radio network. It was easier for me to get in because I already knew how to do or how to edit things and how to use machines that weren't yet used here back then. I think without the Australian education, it would have been harder for me to break in the media front.